Last Friday, Filipina business leaders came together to understand and master the ever-changing digital landscape of business. Laila Pangilinan with the story. The country's top female business leaders gathered at the Dusit Thani in Makati last Friday to prove that tech is no longer just a man's world. The seminar, led by the Women's Business Council, featured young women who excel in the digital and technology sphere. The event also discussed how to create, capture, and deliver value using ICT and digital tools, which are now imperative in doing business. So, meron din tayong mga hindi pa nakakaintindi. So, that's why we have this. And uh, we're bringing all of these experts to talk about it. Para maintindihan ng mga guests natin na importante talaga for people to go into digital transformation for their businesses. It also highlighted the possibility of higher income once entrepreneurs embrace digital transformation. The thing about women is when we earn, what do we do? We don't spend it on ourselves. We spend it on the people that we love, our families, di ba? So, mas marami makaka-benefit if more women are able to do much better using digital transformation. Inai businesswomen share their experience and expertise in digital transformation and how it helped them boost their sales. Just like Chit Wan, she owns a sustainable lifestyle shop and uses the power of social media and online shopping to advertise and sell her products. Through this practice, other small entrepreneurs all over the country can market their goods via her shop and earn money when customers buy their goods. Mula pa nung araw, nag -ano na kami, Twitter, Facebook. Yung amin digital footprint, noong pa lang, inumpisa na namin with Facebook, tapos ang dami mga blogs, ganun. And, of course, of late, yung e-commerce. We're not just in our online store, echostore.ph. We're also in Shopee, Lazada, ganon. For a lot of the, a lot of the popular, popular things. Ngayon po, kung wala kayong website, you don't exist. Kung wala kayong Facebook, you don't exist. One also explained that even customers are moving towards digitalization and companies who won't follow suit will likely fail. All over the world, bumabagsak ang sales ng retail sa traditional stores. Everybody wants to go online. So pag hindi ka sumakay, mapapag-iwanan ka talaga. The event also served as a platform to discuss women's issues in business and possible government policies and solutions through the help of Women Biz PH, the trade department in the Philippine Commission on Women. So at the end of the event, what we really want to see is what's happening in the digital transformation field and for us to create a white paper, which will then be presented by the Women's Business Council to the government so that maybe they can create policies also on how to improve the plight of women. For News 5, Laila Pangilinan, We Are One News.